Hi guys, welcome back. It's your boy Jerry Graphic Design here. Hope you guys are doing good. Today I'm going to show you how to design a Barbie haircut flyer. Use your smartphone and Big Zell app app. Without wasting much of your time, if you love this type of content, consider subscribing and don't forget to turn on the notification bell. Put it on all so that you will be notified whenever we update our channel with a new tutorial like this. Alright guys, before I we forget, please don't skip out whenever you are watching my video. I'm sure you have skipped the first one already. Please do not skip the next ad. As you do, may God bless you. Uh, we're going to use uh, a normal size of Big Z, which is 1280 to 1280. Then click OK. Now I'm going to set a background. The background that I'm going to use is white. I'm going to use a white background. This should be okay. Then there is a resource that I want to uh, import. I want to go with this. Then I will go to um, relative size, take it to 100. This should be okay. Then I will go to erase color. I'll just erase it like this then mark it i haven't done that the next thing that i'm going to do now i want to import the image that i want to use i want to go with this then i will uh, rotate it like this this should be okay then i will take it to the downside just leave the size the way it is i'll just place it here like this Forget the core shape that is at the downside. We are going to use shape to cover it. Then take it back like this. Position it like that. I think we can go with this. Cool. Then mark it. I haven't done that. I'm going to bring out a shape. Then I will give it this particular color, which is this red color. You can use any color that pleases you. Depends the one that favors you. Or the way the depends the one that uh, your client wants. Then I will just bring it down a bit just ensure that it cover this uh sharp shape of this image cool it has covered it this should be okay you can go with this other than that i want to import my text just go to text excellent barber please capitalize this this is the letter here right to ensure that you capitalize it then i will go to color Give it this particular rate, then go to my phones. I will give it a phone. Please, on this note, uh, ensure that you use uh, a phone that is good at it. Don't use any kind of phones. It will not make sense. There is a phone that I use. Here, yeah, this is the phone that I, I want to use. Then I will just mark it, click OK. Then I will position it here. Before then, I want to set my roller. I will place my roller here like this. Then increase the size a bit so that it can be bold a little bit. I think this should be OK. I can go with this. Cool. Then lock it. I haven't done that. The next thing that I'm going to do, I'm going to bring out a text again. Um, excellent. Baba. On this one, no need to capitalize it again. Just capitalize the first alphabet. Then the remaining one you can make use of small letter. Then let it be under this. Then I will give it a font. Leave the colors the way it is. Or you can make it a bit dumb like this. Should be okay. And then I'll go to phones. That is the phones that I used recently. I want to check if I can see it here. It's not here. There is a phone that I want to use.
cool this is the font that i want to use then i will click ok i've not done i'll go to my letter b and then click on this b to bold it then i will increase the size a little bit just a little bit then position it under this excellent let it be at the middle of it like this you can take it off a bit let it be on top of it like this should be okay then lock it i will done that i want to import a shape then i will set my roller to ensure that they are at the same alignment just do something like this should be okay then change the color to this particular red just do something like this i think this should be okay we can go with this just click okay i haven't done that just drag it uh bring it down a bit just space it in between the uh barber a bit like this should be okay we can go with this then lock it let's import a text let's say head cut Oh, hey, oh, let's say hair service. Then click OK. Then let it be uh, imported inside the shape. Then change the color to white. Then go to your phone. So I want to give it a phone. I'm going to go with this particular font. Then I'll go to my letter B, just bold it a bit, then reduce the size so that it can be fitted. Let's position it and check how it looks like. Then I will go to my let's edit it a bit, give it a gap again. Then I'll go to my space to space the letter a bit like this. I think this should be okay. Cool. I haven't done that. The next thing that I'm going to do now, I'm going to bring out the right up, which is I've uh, copied it already. I'll just place it here like this. Cool. Then click OK. I will make it two line, but before then, just reduce the size. And then let's give it a font. Let's give it that same font, which is this. Then board it. This should be okay. Then go to your uh let's make it three light. Three light should be okay. Let's reduce the size again. Then go to color. Just make it dark a bit like this then position it under it on this note i want to change the color of um, some letter here let's change this to red neat a professional you need a professional just change the color to red ensure that you know how to cut it if you didn't know how to cut it just leave it the way how it is like this should be okay cool having done that the next thing i'm going to do now i want to double tap this excellent i'll double tap it and then i will edit because i want to use the same forms let's see we got you covered then click ok then place it under this right up and then reduce the size we are going to change the color of this but let's make it two line two line should be ok then change the color to black let's reduce the size a bit just make it 40 or well, let's leave it at 35 35 should be okay cool 
Having done that, the next thing I'm going to do now, I'm going to bring out a ship. I'm going to bring out a ship, then turn the radio to make the radio 15. Then go to your texture, then import the image that you want to use. I want to go with this, then I'll just rotate it like this. Then make it um scan it to 15 uh, 130 130 should be okay then go to your relative size reduce the size let's say 12 12 should be okay then bring it to the downside i think something like this should be okay and then i will go to my stroke Give it this red column stroke, then make it four. Four should be okay. Then I'll just position it here. I want to bring make it four image. I think I can go with this. I haven't done that. I will bring out another shape, do the same thing. Turn the radius to 50, then go to your texture again, import the second image. Um, let's go with this. Like this should be okay. Then just make it 150, make a scan it to 150. This should be okay. Then go to your relative size, make it 12. The weight is 12. Just make the weight 12. Cool. Then go to your stroke again. Give it the same stroke with the same size. Cool. I think we can go with this. This should be okay. I haven't done that. Let's bring out another shape again. Just repeat the same thing. Then go to your texture again. Um, let's go with this image and see if it will be okay. Cool. This should be okay. Then give it a stroke again. Do, do the same thing. Make the size 4. Then click OK. Go to your relative size. Reduce it to 12. Cool. Then let it be at the downside of this. Ensure that it's at the same alignment. Let it be at the side, at the downside of this. Cool. I think we can go with this. I haven't done that. I want to bring out another shape again. Do the same thing. Go to your texture. I want to go with. Um, let us say this. Cool. Then go to your stroke, give it the same stroke. Then reduce the size, give it the same size. Then click OK. Cool, look amazing, right? Now that we have be able to achieve this, let me drop this back a little bit.
let's lock it lock the four match them together cool this should be okay i haven't done that the next thing i'm going to do now i'm going to uh bring out another shape again let's go to shape then turn the radius to 100 then give it this particular color reduce the size i think we can go with this then place it near this image then take it down a bit let's reduce the size again i think we can go with this or well, let's make it 12 cool I haven't done that. I want to bring out the home icon. I want to import a home icon, which is this. Then I will change the color to, let's say, white. Then reduce the size. Import it inside this shape. Let it be inside the shape. For the size, let's reduce it again. Let's make it um, six. Let's go with six and see if it will be okay. Cool. Then I will go to my text. I will bring out a text. Let's see. Who? Let's capitalize this. Who? Service only. Then I will go to my uh, cough. Just cough it. 200 your left hand side then i'll go to color change the color to white make it white then for the phones i will use this particular phones then for the size increase the size again then ensure that the size enter this shape let's import it and check it and see Let's increase the size again. Let's go to letter B to board it so that it can be a little bit clearer. Then take it closer to uh, the house icon. I think we can go with this. Let's increase the size a bit just a little bit let's make it six should be okay let's check it out if it will be okay cool i haven't done that the next thing i'm going to do now i'm going to bring out a clipper machine which is this and then i will just rotate it a bit like this reduce the size then position it at the downside like this i guess this should be okay then i will uh, go to my filter let's see if we can change the color a little bit take this to 100 I want to change the color cool. I think we can go with this. Then click OK. Lock it. 
haven't done that i'm going to bring out the address icon address icon then i'll go to erase color erase it then give it a um red color give it this particular one then go to your relative size make it four should be okay four should be okay and then bring it to the downside let's reduce the size again let's make it three Cool. I haven't done that. The next thing I'm going to do now, I want to bring out the address. I will just go to my text. Then make it two line then reduce the size go to my color give it red color go to my phones give it this same phones which is this then go to letter b bold it then let it be at the same alignment with this address icon um let's increase the size a bit then i will i will go to my enlightenment keep it at the center enlightenment cool this should be okay Cool. I haven't done that. Um, let's bring out uh, the contact, which is a phone number and the social media. But before then, I want to import the icon, the WhatsApp icon, which is they can reach. They can reach them out through WhatsApp, either their social media icon like Instagram. Then I will just go to relative size. Let's make it four. Then take it to the downside. Change the color to white. Then click OK. Cool. We can go with this. Then let's bring out the phone number uh, plus two, three, four, depending on your country. Give it a white color. Then I will go with this same force. Then for the size, I will love to reduce the size. Then bring it down. Let it be at the same alignment with the uh, WhatsApp icon. Cool. I think we can go with this. Then for the space, I will 
paste the letter a bit then reduce the size again it seems like the size is too big let's make it um 12 should be okay cool i want on that i want to import instagram or instagram icon then do the same thing reduce the size make it four for the color change the color to white for the position take it down let it be at the same alignment cool i think we can go with this for the text just double tap this copy then edit let's bring out the instagram name um excellent baba then for the position position it at the same alignment with this let it be at the same alignment with the instagram icon for the space for the letter space just uh, minus it minus it let's say 10 should be okay then just give it a gap a bit i just want to edit this cool then click okay this should be okay i think we are good to go all right guys look amazing right Thank you guys for watching and God bless you. I always appreciate you guys for stepping, stopping by, by my video. I hope you found this helpful. Please, if you love this, give this video a thumbs up, a like, comment, subscribe, and do well to turn on the notification bell. Put it on all so that you'll be the first person to notify whenever we update our channel with a new tutorial like this. Please, if you find any challenge about this video, you need any help, just drop it at the comment section. I will surely attend to you. See you in the next class. Uh, let's save, okay, before we forget. Just save as PNG and then Ultra. Cool.